there's not one world popular music that's unaffected by the blues. It still exists and it's still very uh, dynamic. These are forms of music that people don't even recognize. A lot of them like what Micah Vine does or Haskell or, or Drink Small. People don't even know exists. We don't care if you sold records. It doesn't mean anything if you sold records. What's that record business? That's something different. We're talking about the culture that spawned American music. If you take an artist who, who may have fallen on hard times um, and, and be living in a lot of poverty, but if they can get a proper instrument in their hand and get, get a respectable stage to play on and bring them an audience, that they will rise to the occasion. No matter how high we raise the bar for these guys to play, like Carnegie Hall, we went with Gabe, or Lincoln Center, or all these festivals in Europe, people have been t obscure for 50 years, they would put on a great show and steal the show. they kill it. I've been traveling around Georgia, Virginia, South Carolina, meeting artists all over the country, and the need was huge. It seemed to go hand in hand um, that the traditional musicians uh, weren't always valued in their communities and had a very difficult time uh, getting by. So we, we started uh, the foundation and started raising money to address those, those very real needs. I learned in Africa to revere our elders because there's so much to learn from them. In this country, we uh, chew up our young and spit out our old people. So there's, there's beauty in both of them. It's not what you get out of this life. It's what you give back, and that's what we're trying to do, give back.